taste, taste, one, two, taste. We're tasting, taste, taste. 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 Well, hello there, and welcome back. I've been told I've moved my hands a lot when I film videos. So I'm going to try not do that in this one. And there we go, I've already shaken the camera, so this is why I probably shouldn't move my hands. Anyway, welcome back. It's been a minute. Before we get into today's video and what it's actually about, I just need to give a big thank you. Like the biggest thank you that has ever been thanked in the entire history of thank yous to everyone who has bought a copy of Ephemera, Short Fictions and Anomalies. Guys, the feedback or the reaction from you guys has been like overwhelming. I could never have expected in a million years that the book would have done as well as it has done. Um, like I know that like it's sitting at about like 70 copies um, sold as of like the filming of this video and like 70 copies might not like sound like a lot to you but for like a first time self-published author it is so much and like I'm so grateful to each and every single one of you that has purchased this book and I hope from the bottom of my heart that you enjoy it and that you revel in it and that you love it um, again thank you thank you thank you um, with that out of the way, uh, if you have not ordered the book yet, just take a look in the description below. There are links where you can order the book off of Amazon uh, US and UK if you live that side. If you live in South Africa, there'll be details in the description below about how you can order the book through me. And also, like, it entered into a competition where you can win some goodies. There's also going to be a couple links down there um, to my previous video where I go through, like, what you could win if you do pre-order the book. So yes, once again, thank you to everyone who has ordered. If you are interested and you'd like to order, check out the links in the description below. And um, yeah, I guess we'll chat soon. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, let's get into the reason why we are filming today. Guys, I'm so excited. So this has nothing to do with my book. This is just for fun. I felt like changing it up a bit, switching up the content a bit. Um, so, story time. I was busy scrolling through Instagram uh, like a couple days ago and I came across this like amazing uh, company that does like bespoke stationery and like fun boxes and stuff. The name of the company is Waddles and Radley and um, they have done a box dedicated to one of my all-time favorite movies. Are any of you perhaps familiar with this? <laughs> because I am. I grew up watching Hocus Pocus um, over and over and over again. My brother and I rented the VHS copy from our local video store so many times we probably ran the tape rugged. I adore this movie, it is one of my favorites. I try to watch it every year around this time, Halloween. It is spooky season, so um, I love Hocus Pocus. So when I saw that Waddles and Radley had released a Hocus Pocus box with a whole bunch of awesome Hocus Pocus goodies inside, of course I bought it, like you even need to ask. So that's what this video is about today. Uh, the box arrived earlier today. I would love to say that it took every ounce of my self-control not to open the box uh, before this video, which would also kind of prove pointless, but I've been so busy that there really hasn't been time. Um, so I'm super excited. I put some time aside tonight to film this video and do this unboxing. I have not touched it. It is still in its original wrapping. These are my scissors. These are my handy dandy unboxing scissors. So today we are going to unbox the Waddles and Radley or the Waddle Box Hocus Pocus edition and uh, take a look at the goodies that are inside. Obviously I have seen what's inside this box because I ordered it, um, but I haven't actually had the physical experience yet of all these Hocus Pocus goodies. I'm a massive fan. So without further ado, sisters, we unbox. So without further ado, here is the box. Oh shit, shift, shut, shit. Stuff just shifted around inside, but I'm sure it's fine. They've actually packaged it like really, really nicely. So it's like all protected. The box is like really sturdy, which I was not expecting. I don't know what to expect, to be honest. But um, this is what it looks like. It's pretty big. It's like two of my head. No, like one, one book. How many heads? One and a half? One and a half heads. Okay, Banner has confirmed that it's one and a half of my heads big. Um, so yeah, let's get into this. Let's do this. Okay, here we go. Snip, snip. Like I said, it was like really nicely packaged. So maybe we should just go in from the side here. This is a budget channel, okay? So I'm not gonna 
be filming from different angles. If you want that, then go to a different channel. <laughs> okay, we are through the bubble wrap. And it is out, or almost out of the box. Yeah, I think the bubble wrap did a really good job of keeping it protected. Um, well, I suppose that's where that remains to be seen. Like if things are in a million pieces, then obviously not. Uh, Look at that. It has my name on it and everything. See, that's my name. That's my name. Say my name. Say my name. There we go. So this is what it looks like. Let's unbox this bitch. Okay, time for the big reveal. We've seen what the box looks like. It's beautiful. Let's unribbon this. So beautiful. I love ribbon. It ties things together. Makes them pretty. You can use it afterwards. Recycle it. It's awesome. Oh my goodness, guys, this stuff. Oh wow, okay, so there's like a whole breakdown, like immediately in the box of all the goodies, what is in here. But I mean like, you didn't come here to watch that, you came here to see all the cool shit. So I'm just gonna go from like what's on top to like what's at the bottom. Like you can sort of see it like sort of like this, sneak peek, sneak peek. Let's start with Dead man's toe! Dead man's toe! It's a shiny dead man's toe sticker. This is awesome. Like, I'm a sticker whore. I love collecting stickers. Maybe I should show you guys my sticker collection one day. But there's dead man's toe from the movie, which is awesome. A little shiny, shiny sticker. This came out really pretty. Look how sparkly it is. This is awesome. I love it. Ooh, and we have here the book bookmark. <laughs> the tiny little bookmark. I think it's magnetic. I might be lied, or it's just tab. I don't know. Like, I read stuff and then I don't pay attention. So let's open it. And then see how this works. It is magnetic. Ha ha, look at that. Magnets, I think. Are they magnets? Oops. Yes, they're magnets. They're magnets. It has been confirmed. They are magnets. And look, it's the book from the movie. The spell book. The Sanderson sister spell book. I think that is so cute. And then on the back it says, Boo, come to mommy. Book. There we go. There's the book bookmark. Then we have, I think these are stickers. Yes, they're stickers. Look at the sticker collection. That's so cool. You've got Winifred and Mary and Sarah and a cauldron and the vacuum cleaner and the broom. Oh, no, that's the mop and then the other broom. And then we have here lies. Ye body of Emily Binks, beloved daughter and sister, died ye 31st of October, 1693. This is such a cute little sticker collection. Like, how adorable is this? This is amazing. <gasps> like, the effort, guys, the effort. Like, if you look at their hair, they're like little purple lightning thingies in their hair. This is so cool, so well done. I'm so impressed by this so far, like, I'm blown away. This is amazing. Next thing. Okay, this is like an A5 artwork, and I just think that this is like to die for cute. Come, we fly! And then you've got like the broom, the vacuum cleaner, and the mop. Let me um, let me get this out of its plastic, and then we can have a look. Sorry, for a second there, I thought we weren't filming, and I nearly died. But then I saw the little timer was ticking, so everything was fine. So if you were wondering what that was, that was me subtly shitting myself. <laughs> but anyway, let's get this thing out of its wrapping. How cute is that? This is adorable. Like, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I mean, like, I could put it somewhere. Somewhere cute, somewhere nice. This packaging is, like, dope, guys. Like, seriously, everything looks amazing coming out of this, this little box. So, yeah, there we have a little A5 artwork. That was almost on the floor because I'm clumsy. There's the A-fly, A5 artwork. Then we have this cute little collection of notes so you've got the three sanderson sisters there and the full moon and the forest behind them and this actually just looks so gorgeous we love it's just a bit of hocus pocus it says here at the top i'm in love with this everyone's going to get like handwritten letters on hocus pocus stationery well 15 people are so here we go there is the notebook then we have another sticker and this one is apparently glow in the dark it's the moon it's the full moon i uh, will test this out and see how glowy it is and I'll probably end up putting it up on my Instagram stories if you guys want to see the sticker in action 
uh, follow me on Instagram. My handle will be somewhere around here. And you can check out the Waddle Box Hocus Pocus sticker in all its luminescent glory. Check that out. Okay, so there we have that sticker. Then we have these awesome postcards. And this is probably like the most famous quote from the movie. Everybody loves this quote. And the little postcards say, Oh look, another glorious morning. Makes me sick. That's how Beth Midler says it. We love Beth Midler, especially in Hocus Pocus. Let me get these out of there. I think everything is so beautifully packaged. I cannot believe it. It looks so good. I was actually looking for packaging similar to this for my book. And I couldn't find it anywhere. So Waddles and Radley, if you're out there, um, maybe you could just slide into my DMs and tell me where you get your packaging because it's dope. Okay, the box, everything looks amazing. And there are, there are the little postcards. I think they're supposed to be two. Yes, they're two. There are the little postcards. How dope are those? So cute. We love. We love. Okay, then some other stuff that came in the box. It's just some black envelopes that go with the note cards. Um, like, I love stationery, so I'm all down for, like, a black notebook or a black envelope. This is stunning. Then we have these cute little, oh, these are adorable, um, I suppose they're like placeholders or something, they call them paper clips, but they've got cute little thingies on them, look at these cute little paper clips, oh that one doesn't want to come up, there we go. So we have a little cauldron, a little cauldron, bubble bubble, toil and trouble, and a little Thackeray Binks, look at that, look at that, I don't know how people get things to focus. I'm a bad YouTuber. But anyway, there we go. So they're these babies, which are adorbs. And then we have the black flame candle. I'm guessing this is also a bookmark. But there it is. It's very cute. Let's get this one out of its packaging so you can get a better look at it. Everything is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. Like, I was reading reviews on their website and people have been really blown away by this stuff because obviously this isn't like the first box they've ever done. They do like a theme box every month, I think. You should definitely check out their website. I'll leave a link to their website in the description as well and you can have a look. Look at that, this is so cute. I love stuff like this. It's the black flame candle lit by a virgin. There we go, check that out. Oh my gosh, there's so much going on in here. <laughs> Woo! Okay, what's next, what's next? There's so much going on in here. Um, oh well, um, sure. All right, let's have a look at this. I'm not sure what this is, but it's really cute. It says, Dost thou comprehend? And it's a little Winifred. Let's open her up and see. Because there's supposed to be magnets in here. I haven't found them yet. And I don't know if these are the magnets. I don't know. I'm like not good with details. But here we have, oh, they're just like little cards. This is so cute. So we have Winifred going, Dost thou comprehend? And then we have Mary suggesting we form a calming circle. I am calm. And we have Sarah. Amok, 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 amok. This artwork is so cute. And each of these have come with a little envelope in like a corresponding color for each of the sisters. I think that that is absolutely gorgeous. So you could like write a note to someone, slip it in here, you know, and be like, I put a spell on you and now you're mine. You know, that's, that's how you get a date. I gave dating advice in my last video too. Obviously I'm full of advice. Anyway, what do we have next? This is a bottle of soda or a can of soda water, but it says, oh my goodness, oh, the label just came off. Um, burning rain of death, tis but soda water. How cute is that? <laughs> tis but soda water. And then there are some goodies in here that you can infuse the soda water with. I don't know about you guys, I'm going away this weekend and I'll be infusing my soda water with some gin. Like this video if you drink gin, if you infuse with gin, because that's what I'll be doing. And then, like, this is just such a cute little clever idea. So it's like, um, I don't know what you call this, Madbella, Madbella, I don't know what we call it here. Um, but it's like dry cracker, it's like crackers, but it's called toast crackers, I don't know. Anyway, and it says, it's a quote from the movie, it says, You know, I've always wanted a child, and now I think I'll have one, on toast. How cute is that? I just love this movie, I think it's so quotable, obviously. I'm not the only one that thinks that. Then we have some goodies. This is a not so lucky rat's tail. And some sweeties. And it's like that red licorice. I love this kind of licorice. I don't like dark licorice. Like I don't like black, black licorice. I like the red licorice. Um, so I'll definitely be biting into these. And then we have 
another piece of or some more candy. I don't even know where they got these. I've never seen these anywhere. But it's a bit of thine own tongue. If you have not watched Hocus Pocus, like I don't know what you're doing this far into the video. Go stop the video right now. Go watch Hocus Pocus and then come back, okay? And then we can talk. But this was just genius. This is so cute. A bit of thine own tongue. And there's one for me and there's one for Bano. If he's still listening. We'll see. Anyway. Cute bit of thine own tongue. Let's see. Very nicely wrapped. Look at all of this. Look at all of this. You know, I'm going to reuse all of this. Like, when I send stuff, like competition, giveaway stuff, I always recycle my packaging. I never just throw it away because that shit's expensive. So I always uh, recycle the stuff that I get, that I order. So anyway, uh, another treat we have. This is called a Twix or treat. Chocolate covered finger. <laughs> that was clever. There you go. I'm going to enjoy this one too. It's awesome. Like, Halloween's about candy as well. And there's, like, so much candy in this box. It's so cool. Waddles and Radley, you guys have done such an amazing job. I'm super impressed so far. Then we have one of the things that I was most looking forward to because you know how I feel about candles. And there is a candle. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. It says there, I lit the candle, as in the black flame candle. And then on the inside, there is a little black candle. And this is the most gorgeous, like purple. Like I wasn't expecting this. I thought it was going to be a lot darker. And oh my gosh, this is like textured. That's like really cute. I love this. Love this journey for me. Hocus Pocus journey. There we go. That is going straight on top of my bookcase because that just looks so cute. I can't wait to light this. That will also be on my Instagram at some stage if you guys would be interested in watching it. Okay, then the last item. I think these are the magnets. Um, let's have a look in here. Sisters! Oh, these are the magnets and they are so little and they are so cute. Okay, so with this box, you could buy... You could like opt for one magnet or you could opt for all three. And like, of course I got all three because how do you with just like one Sanderson sister? You gotta get all three. Sarah, Mary, Winifred. Okay. Let's have a look here. Here. Oh, and they're all like stuck together. This is so cute. So here we have Winifred. These are going on the fridge. Oh, you can't see them. Focus. It's so bad at this. But anyway, there's Winifred. How cute is she? And then we have Mary with her hair. Like, how adorable is that? So cute. So cute. Guys, just check out my Instagram. There'll be photographs of this stuff all over my Instagram because I love it so much. And then we have Sarah. Look at her. She just wants a boy to play with. Can we play with him? Is it a boy? Oh my gosh. This is so cool. Okay, well, that's the box. Guys, if you made it this far into the video, thank you very much. Please go check Waddles and Radley out because this stuff is just like the cutest. I adore. I stand. Go check them out. Maybe go order the next box. I don't know what it's going to be. But yeah, and thank you for coming. And happy Halloween. And thank you for ordering my book. And thank you for reading my book during Halloween. And being scared. And if you have anything to say, or if you've got some comments, leave them down below. You know how we roll here. Leave those comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe, like, do all the good YouTube things. Here I go, moving my hands again. This is just how we roll here. Stay safe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.